action continues at World of Disney, the stitch has been removed. It kind of looks weird. I know. Jason, Ghirardelli, we're heading into co-op right now. We're going to meet Ashley Eckstein. I think I said her name right. Um, she's actually one of the founders and designers for the Her Universe collection. And she's on a book tour right now. I definitely think that's the line to see her, so we'll see. We're back at the DVC member location. And this is the line. Looping into... Co-op. Where you can meet Ashley and Ashley Taylor. How funny, they're both Ashleys. And then I think this is a break in the line so they can allow people to shop. Because it looks like it continues here and all through right there. So we've still got a little bit of time to wait here. There's the book right here at the back with the cashier. And she's right there. So cool! So neat. Spotted the Cinderella bags. I told you, they're huge. Yeah, I don't, I don't know that I want one. I, maybe if I were to get something, I would get the wallet. Because these are really big. I love the little braided detail on the zipper. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Is the interior red? Looks like it. Yeah. Just plain red with the leather detail. And it's just a big open tote, essentially. And this one is the smaller prints. The Texas Cinderella with a little shoe. Um, it's got adjustable hands. I love that. I mean, it's beautiful. It just is large. This one's two ninety, dollars so more expensive than this big one. That one lady just fixed all these and now I'm unzipping them all. <laughs> We'll zip it back up. Red. And it's got the drop pockets and the key fobs on the inside like typical Doonies do. And there's a the extension strap. It's just hard to show when it's filled with padding. And then here's the wallet. It's 158. And it's got the smaller It's pattern. so cute though. I love that Jacques and Gus Gus are featured. Because you can fit your phone in there. Yeah. And your lip gloss or whatever. So it's this is the perfect size we're taking to the park. Right. And they have quite a selection. We are heading out of the co-op area and across through Aribis Brothers. And I wanted to show you, they have these new Coco um, pieces. This is a necklace. It's, what was that? 89. 89. Ooh. Well, you know. These earrings are so pretty. And they match with that necklace. Mm -hmm. 85. These ones are without the little design underneath. So just the skull. 79. We're getting less. <laughs> so th this one matches with those earrings. Mm. Little crystals in the eyes. I like that they give you an option. 49. If you don't like the I love flourish. the guitar. Look at all the little diamond crystals. That's really pretty. That one is 49. I so probably like that one the best. So if you're doing a Coco Dapper Day look. I saw somebody did that this year. It was so cute. And this ring. Ooh, and, and on the, the side. The side. That's cool. And those are 45? Same thing. Same, yeah, same thing. Very cool. We also have these hollowed glass skulls. These are a little more difficult to show you because the sunlight is coming in right behind them. But they're very brightly colored with reds, pinks, blues, yellows, and this is mom showing you they're hollow, so you can stick a tea line underneath them. They're 69. They're really pretty. I'm actually gonna pull one down away from the sun and see if that helps. Oh yeah, much better, okay. Yeah, so you can see the bright colors. So for example, if you do an altar for your loved ones, mm -hmm. for the day of the and you put a little candle in there, that's so pretty. It's very pretty. People would love that. Yeah, definitely come check them out. They're really pretty. So you can see all the colors. Wow. 
I don't know that they're glass or if they are glass. They are glass. They're, they're thick. just a very thin glass because they're white. Yeah, those are cool. Walking to the Disney, I think it's called the Disney Corner, or no, is that the other one we went to see? There's a new store that opened on West Side that we're going to check out. So as we're heading there, spotted the construction for Wolfgang Puck, right next to Coca-Cola. So this area right here is pretty shallow. They've got quite a bit of construction on the um, Planet Hollywood, right? So kind of interesting. Here's Disney style, right next to the AMC Dine-In Theater and Starbucks on the other side. Yeah. However, the wallpaper, the Disney Springs wallpaper, is still up in the windows, which makes me think it's not open. So, I must have read the date wrong. It's going to be huge though. It's this whole corner store. So this was originally the Harley Davidson shop that they have since taken out of Disney Springs and I don't think that they, did they move it? Yeah, we remember they moved it down there by the world company and that tiny little shop. Oh, okay. So they just downsized a bit. There's Edison straight out there. Here's Starbucks. Yeah, it's definitely not open yet. But this is... Oh, bummer. Here's the smallest of sneak peeks. We were told by a cast member she thinks it opens on the 12th, so darn it, I guess I'll just have to come back. It's not like I'm not here all the time anyway.